Right. Be- well, it's because we live in a very uh, spiritual world and this is a satanic lie and there's a lot of evil um, uh, evil in the world. And the, the, the way they get away with all this evil is people can't imagine that evil exists. Therefore, if they can't imagine it, it'll um, it'll just happen and, and the, it'll get around them. Today, I will have a look at David Weiss or Dirt, as I call him, when he tries to explain flat earth. This is from some kind of online interview with David Weiss. It's it's a group of people, I don't know who they are, that are asking him some basic questions about flat earth. It's obvious that they are not flat earther, they are curious in this stupidity. So let's listen to David Weiss trying to explain why he believes that they are lying about the shape of the earth. I will stop sometimes and make quite fast comments because it's not so many things to comment about besides he's a fool, he's a liar. So let's start this dumpster fire. Right, well it's because we live in a very uh, spiritual world and this is a satanic lie and there's a lot of evil um, uh, evil in the world and the, the, the way they get away with all this evil is people can't imagine that evil exists therefore if they can't imagine it it'll um, it'll just happen and, and the, it'll get around them what is this fool trying to say what difference does the world does the shape of the world make well there is no difference it does make a difference the shape it's the lie that matters the big problem is that you haven't proven that is a lie what difference does it make I have to go to work on Monday I said it I said all the things right I used to, I, I worked my way up through corporate America. I started my own business, super successful. I had a, 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 a great, great situation, making tons of money, American dream. I got the whole thing. And I walked away from it all because this is the most important topic of our time. This is the one that unplugs us from the matrix. This is the one that frees us from the tyranny that's going on. So David Weiss wants us to believe that he left a successful business to spend all his time spreading silly conspiracies and lies. What difference does it make? Well, there's a there's a thing where he who created it owns it. So we're born into God's world, into nature, into natural uh, the natural world, and there's natural law, and we are inheritors of this realm equally. But the, the, the controllers have made it where they immediately register us to a corporation at birth and they tell us we live on this spinning ball and if you live on their ball field, you play with their rules. A lot of words, a lot of nonsense and no explanations. And uh, that's how they control us. For example, um, they, if you look at um, all of the music industry, all of it, all of the, 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 the movies industry, all of the video games. And I think you could add into that all of the professional sports teams, all of that together is less than space, what they spend on space yearly. Okay. Space is the biggest money laundering system in the world. Let's look a bit closer on those numbers. Space, $410 billion per year. The governments in the world did hit a record 2022 and totally they spent 103 billion US dollars on space programs. And here you can see the spendings on NASA. The peak was in the middle of the 60s. NASA gets around 0.5% of the US budget. Ever. And it's how they control us because they, it makes us insignificant. It hides us from the creator. Um, there's a there's a, a quote in the Bible, a verse that basically says, once you see my creation, you can no longer deny my existence. Well, they don't want you in that situation where you can't deny the creator because it's hard to control people that have a connection to God. So they're doing everything they can by demoralizing us and hiding us and diluting God. It put it, How do you dilute something? You put it into something bigger, 
right? You pour it into something bigger like infinite expanding space. They tell us space is expanding. I think it's a billion miles a minute or something like that. It's the dumbest thing ever. It, it, it's ridiculous. They're, they're just lying. So, so money, I don't think money is the reason that they do it. I think it's more to hide God. Why would they hide God? It makes no sense at all. If you look at US, for instance, majority of the people is Christians and many of them believe in God. So why the need of hiding God? He don't give any explanation to that at all. And um, they, um, what else I got here? Um, so if, uh, if, Also, you know, as, as I was saying before, your thoughts create your reality. If you're trapped in a globe of limitations, if you're afraid that they're going to start a nuclear war and don't realize that nuclear bombs don't exist as described. And he is an atomic bomb denier. This disgusts me. This is from Nagasaki. After the bombings of Nagasaki and Hiroshima in the upcoming four months, about 200,000 people lost their lives. And the years to come, many died of cancer and so on. And this idiot tells people that it's not true. If you, if you think that we're overpopulated, um, maybe you won't have enough kids, but have more kids. It's all about population control. I believe that in the old world, if you start looking into that, there's tons of stuff on the app about it, um, that there was trillions of people here. Trillions. Okay, not billions, trillions. And um, and there's so much evidence of that, it's it's unreal. But um And once again, he makes statements after statement after statement, all without any evidence at all. David Weiss loves to listen to his own voice, but he don't care if he lies, if he has any evidence at all. If you live in a small world, you have small thoughts and it limits your imagination. It limits your creative ability. And if you live in fear, your your ability to manifest is not nearly as strong. So, you know, what difference does it make? You know, if you lived, let's say you lived in a building, right? Let's say there's this cool building, you know, they're building that line out in Saudi Arabia, whatever it's called. Well, imagine a building 500 miles long by 500 miles wide and it's 400 stories tall okay cool you're born in there there's football stadiums in there there's colleges in there there's costcos in there there's trains in there there might even be airplanes 500 miles that's pretty far right so this is a giant building but every time you get within a mile of the outside wall there's military there that goes no 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 you can't go there we have to protect the penguins there's penguins that live out there right and there's ice we don't want you to infecting the ice And you're like, okay. And then somebody goes, there's more out there. There's more. And you're like, what difference does it make? I'm fine right here in my little ball. Those who are limited is those who believes in fools like David Weiss. A small pancake shaped world with the dome over it. If you look at reality with the globe and a huge universe around you that's not to be limited right they don't want you to know what are all wars fought over all of them resources and land what if they're fighting for land resources normally governments are those who start wars and david weiss claims that the governments hide the fact about more land and more resources and it's obvious that David Weiss don't see the problem with that explanation they're hiding more land and resources they're hiding the creator they're hiding your true power this is the most important topic and also if you're lost in space spinning out of control living in fear and in lack they can make you believe that the boogeyman's floating through the air and if you breathe on your friend they're going to die and it's going to be your fault I have relatives and close friends who died in the pandemic, but David Weiss believes it was to control us. Disgusting. Right, they can make you believe in anything if you believe you're flying through space. 
If you don't have a foundation to God's creation, then you are lost in space and you'll never live to your full potential. Now, you might be happy. You might have money. You might have a nice house. You might go on vacation here and there, right? Okay? But that's not what this is all about. This is all about, you know, government. What is government? Why does government think that they're in charge of us? We're in charge of them. God, man, government. Government's trying to get on top of God, right? They're already on top of us in your mind, not in my mind. I mean, not... not in, in the no, in regular people's minds, I'm not trying to insult anybody. It's quite obvious that David Weiss haven't read the U.S. Constitution, or perhaps he haven't understand it, because you have a freedom of religion in U.S. and since the beginning, the Congress, the state, have been separated from the church. So you're not allowed to make laws based on religion in the country you live in. So David Weiss is free to believe in any God he wants or not believe in a God. That's a freedom that many people in this world don't have. But David Weiss don't understand it. But government is here for us, but they're not here for us. They're all corrupt. They're all, um, you know, in it together, and um, you know, they're 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 literally satanic. It, it's crazy, the, the the stuff that they're into. So, you know, why the lie? You know, they're they're hiding uh, free energy. They're hiding uh, um, your spirituality. They're hiding more land. What's going on here? Um, they're hiding scientific knowledge. What's in Antarctica? Uh, that we're at the center of creation. Are hiding how special you are. So if you want to just ignore that and not see the full creation of this fantastic opportunity that we have to experience this realm, you know, that's why for me it is the most important topic ever. Free energy over oh there. And let's zoom in on his text. I can only find one true statement, and it's this one. I don't know. Yes, that's the only true thing in this video. David Weiss don't know anything. He make up stories, he lies and, and are not able to present any type of evidence for his claims. I was supposed to go to Ukraine today, but I had some work to do, so I have to push it one week ahead. So, or more than one week after Easter, I will go to Ukraine. So, I trying to buy as many parts I, that I can find for drones. Uh, so, if you want to have, help me help Ukraine, I would be so happy if you use PayPal. I hope you liked the shorter video. Uh, I also hope that you have looked at my uh, first video in the series about the Cold War. I will be back soon. So have a nice weekend all. See you soon. Bye.